Today we learned more about the Washington State Department of Agriculture's plan to eradicate the second hive located in Whatcom County. Q13 News reporter Frankie Thompson is live in that area where that nest was discovered. And Frankie, we know that these giant Asian hornets are a huge issue. Yeah. We know that, absolutely, and beekeepers are definitely worried about the threat of these Asian giant hornets. That live nest was found just down the street here, east of Blaine. Now, it was located at the base of a tree at someone's property. This is the first live nest the State Department of Agriculture found this year and will be eradicated this week. The department placed trackers on three hornets one of them led back to the live nest. Entomologists say it is critical finding these invasive bugs while they're still alive because they are highly dangerous to honeybees. One, bee one beekeeper says the hornets killed an entire colony of about 60,000 bees in 2019. But back then, he says he didn't know what caused the gruesome attack. Shortly after that incident, the state's first sighting of the Asian giant hornet was reported a few miles away from his property. He says he was frightened to hear the live nest was also really close to his hives this time around. I've been living in fear, basically. I mean, it's, 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 it's very disheartening to, to never know when the murder hornets are going to show up and slaughter your bees. Um, they didn't the beekeeper says more public awareness is the key to beating Asian giant hornets and saving honeybees. He says if you think you see a hornet, don't kill it. Take a picture, note where the bug is located and which direction it flies away. Send those details immediately to the Department of Agriculture to help them track down the nest. Coming up, hear why the beekeeper says if we don't can, if we don't contain and eradicate the hornets as fast as we can, we could see food prices go up. Reporting live in Blaine, Frankie Thompson, Q13 News.